In this video, I will show you how to get your Discord token. So just a quick note, you can only do this on discord.com. You can't do this on the app. So what you will need to do first is open up a browser and come across to discord.com. And if you're not already, you just want to go ahead and log into your account. And also just a quick note that you can only do this on either Google Chrome or Mozilla Firefox. Those are the two browsers you're going to want to use. So to get your token is very, very easy to do. But just another quick note that with this token, you do want to keep it to yourself. You don't want to share this with anyone because people can actually use that token to get into your account. So you want to make sure if you ever do this that obviously you don't share with anyone otherwise they can get access to your discord so once you're at discord and you're logged in what you're going to want to do is come up to the top right hand corner and just go ahead and click these three dots up here to bring up the menu what you then need to do is come down to more tools and then come across and click on to developer tools down at the bottom so what's going to happen it's going to load up a screen that's going to look like this and what you're going to do at the top of the page is click on to application so if you can't see this here you might need to click these arrows next to the top and application will be in here and once you've clicked onto application you then want to come down and click onto this local storage and then there'll be discord.com so you just want to go ahead and click onto that this is going to open up a screen that's going to look like this and then all you need to do from here is come up to this filter box at the top and go ahead and type token and of course i've blurred mine out for security reasons and you can see the token values down here and this value in the box here where it says value is your actual token so what you can do is just highlight that click copy and then you can paste that wherever you need to so i hope this video helped you out today and if it did help you out then please leave a like and be sure to subscribe to the channel for more awesome tutorials and with that being said i will see you in the next one